Hey, how you doing? Jamie here. Uh, I want to talk to you about the 2021 Jeep Mojave. Uh, there's some people out there, I've seen videos, and apparently it's a common misconception or they just don't know what they're talking about. All right. So let me give a little education course here. The hood scoop on the Mojave, it's not real. It's decorative to just, I'm assuming, to distinguish the Mojave. Um, the Rubicon has a different setup on the hood, just as I believe the Willys and the Sport models. Okay, this is not a functioning scoop. Okay, allow me to show you. Come this way. All right, now we got the hood open. And as you can clearly see, you can clearly see the hood liner or the hood pad, however you want to reference it. Okay, look. It's just decorative. So that ends that, okay? Just the facts here. All right, however, I would like to show you something really cool. This has a forced air induction, something similar. However, it's right here. Let's take a look. Right here, you'll see a hole. Oh, I don't know, maybe two inches wide, possibly two and a half, three inches long. That comes back through here, through the duct to work. It comes up through here, goes into your air cleaner box, and also through here. Okay? That is pretty much a forced air induction setup, which is really cool. Now, that's why instead of replacing all of this with something K&N uh, or any other uh, aftermarket part, performance part, I chose to just pull out the old factory filter and replace it with a K&N filter because I don't need to change all that because you already have the forced air induction right here. So, if you want to spend the money on the aftermarket parts and do that, go ahead. You're not going to get a whole lot for your money. But anyhow, I just wanted to do a quick little video and end the uh, miscommunications, the misinformation about the Mojave and the hood scoop. It's decorative. It's not functional. Until next time. See you later.